little village is made up of two residence halls, Alpine and Pinon. They're actually really modern. They kind of have like really sleek styles, like really bold colors, as well as having cool lounges that have like spiral staircases and kitchens. You walk in Alpine, it's more of a retro feel in the building because all the colors are designed to, to focus on electricity, whereas in Pinion, if you walk in, it's really earthy toned, it's brown, beige, and green. Um, the study areas are much larger, it's more focused for like a, a CNS major. Laurel Village is really unique in that one third of the students here are actually returners, whereas the other two thirds are all College of Natural Sciences majors. So, like physics, mathematics, biology, zoology, um, they all pretty much have the same base and prerequisite courses. Science takes a lot of hard work and it really comes in handy being able to form those study groups. So it's just really helpful in that you can work with other people, get other points of views, and kind of learn how to get through the problems in maybe a different way than you would by yourself. We have multiple classrooms and there's a big, big open room that you can go study in with separate little study rooms that you can block off if you need to be quiet. And then we have our full, uh, full wall whiteboards, which are amazing. Just the board is covered in writing um, for studying. It's just awesome to see the community get together like that. Little Village, the, the coolest thing about it is just all the different, different living styles. Like on every floor, there's you can have a, you can live in a single, you can live in a double live on a community style bathroom or you can live in a quad with other people so it's not exclusive to what you're studying or your economic availability. The rooms in Lower Village are awesome. They're also quads. They're really nice. Um, you kind of get that own privacy but you're still right next to someone else um, so you can kind of just shut your door and go away if you want but open up the door and you're in the community right there. Lower Village is also really close to two different dining centers. But it's definitely nice to have both Corbett and Durrell on both sides of LV. Durrell has a like, make your own pasta, stir fry type um, station. Durrell also has a sandwich station kind of similar to Subway where you can get a toasted sandwich and put whatever you want on it. The other dining center that it's pretty close to is Corbett. It does a lot of actually theme nights. I know they do like a chocolate fondue night as well as they have like regular like Tex-Mex and they have a burger place. And then Lower Village is also right next to the IM Fields and the Rec Center which is personally my favorite place on campus. Um, it's great to go work off some stress or just get huge. <laughs> so I'm part of Air Force ROTC. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday from 6 to 7 a.m. Uh, we'll, do, we'll do a workout and it's actually nice again being in Laurel Village because our workouts are at the rec center. And you know, just working out for an hour, hungry. So I'll head right over to Corporate or Durrell because they're so close. You can hit all your macros, you can get your carbs, you can get your protein, you can get your fats, you can eat endlessly if you want. And I always have a great wide choice and I always have like the cookies which you shouldn't eat, but you know, they got them. Well, there's a lot of cool common areas in Laurel Village, one of them being the courtyard outside that's in between Pinon and Alpine. The way the rocks are laid out, it's like an auditorium. So we just had like an open mic night where residents would come and they would either play music on their guitars, do cool talents, or they, a lot of them sang and it was really cool to see how many people could sing. We're just going to do a final closing act and then we're going to finish up for the night. I played my bass. Apparently it sounded pretty good. So we got that pavilion in the middle, this big kind of thing, which is kind of cool, I guess. Um, no, it's really awesome. We got the big, big wall there that you can hook up and watch movies on. Um, and you can see it from inside your dorm if you want to just watch it from there and stay warm and kind of check out what's going on. Or you can go out there and there's a fire pit there too, so why not stay warm outside, you know? Um, and then inside we got this big living wall, uh, super sustainable, and it's a living wall. Like, you can't beat a living wall, you know? Um, and then on top of that, hammocks. You can hang out in a hammock and watch the living wall. Life doesn't get better than that. You can hook up big TVs, play foosball, play pool, you know. We got a lot of stuff and there's study rooms in there too and a bike shop. Um, not many people have a bike shop right next to their room, you know. The chain's broken, whatever. Just go into spokes, you can get that fixed right away. It's really awesome. In Laurel Village, it hasn't been lived in before, so it's like we set the standard for everybody else that comes after us and we get to figure things out and find out what's fun, what's what we can do here, and just spend some fun time developing a new community. Back, chest, shoulders, arms, legs. No cardio, nobody likes cardio.